You've nowhere to run, Bard. Give me the stick of truth. Take it from me if you can, Wizard King. Step forward now and fulfill your d-d-d- And fulfill your d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-
The RPG elements are a perfect way to drive the immersion, right? The freedom, the exploration, the customization. These functional elements of the game enhance the other things this game does so well. That being the feeling of being in South Park. Yeah, I just, I really can't say enough about this game. And, and I mean, forget the crap reviewers and gamers typically get bogged down by. What matters most is that this game is incredibly fun. And it's about the full experience, you know? That feeling of being in the show. It's just done so well, it's almost eerie. Like, you almost forget this is a game sometimes. It's that seamless. And shameless, too. Suck it in. Let it ramble. Dragon time! Like I said, check out my review of the PS3 version for my full thoughts, but rest assured that it's just as good on the Xbox 360. The presentation, the graphics, the music, the gameplay, it's all top notch. And you're also best friends with Butters, which means game of the year, basically. It's South Park, the stick of truth for the Xbox 360. And now I'm going to make you my friend on Facebook. This is very prestigious. You have my email now, but don't give it out to anybody. I'm super serial. Hurry! We must know if Man Bear Pig is here or not. <laughs>